Hello, my friends, and welcome back to The Long Dark on our Interloper playthrough. This is episode 100, and we are currently quite exhausted after just making it back to the maintenance yard during an aurora. Let's head inside and uh, have a look around. Alright, man, this place is really lit up and quite dangerous. Looks like I don't want to... Probably don't want to mess around with it. Um, you know, I think I'm just going to sleep in the bed in the next room. <laughs> Let's play it safe. Yeah, right in here. We do have a bed, fortunately. Let's drink up. Yeah, yeah, let's uh, sleep for 10 hours. Nice. We've survived 198 days. Oh, we're getting so close to uh, 200 days. Okay. Um... Now, in our previous episode, we did take down that bear. And at some point, we would like to bring back the, uh, the bags or harvest him up. Let's see what the temperature is like. Ooh, it's quite cold. Um, you know, I'm going to grab a bunch of firewood. And let's see if we can cook up that bear meat. be nice if we could cook it up outside before we... Uh, so, you know, to try to prevent me from having to... Bring back all of those bags of meat. Okay, firewood is... Let's. Well, first of all, let me see if I need to drop anything here. Got the fresh... Oh, dang it, guys. I forgot to drop that. I should have dropped that to get it curing. Um, when we went to sleep. That, that's okay. Let's see. Anything else we, we've got? Drop that. Ah, uh, I could drop a liter of water. Okay, let's make sure I have on the camel. Yeah, I do. The camel. <laughs> I was going to say camel bag. Moosehide satchel. Okay. Um, let's get some firewood. Okay. Let's see if we can get to this uh, bear. You know, we also took down a uh, an aurora wolf. Let's get out a torch just in case. You know, I, ha I think I've killed a lot of wolves. There's still probably some lingering around here. Be nice if we could get some more uh, mushrooms as well. Uh, whoops. Now I probably should keep an eye out for some old man's beard to try to replace the ones that we've uh, we've used. Okay, I've got a wolf up ahead. Two wolves. Now there's something up there as well. Is that a wolf? I thought I saw something. 
Just rabbit? Just rabbit, okay. We got a couple rabbits here. Yeah. He was too far. I do want my rock back. Oh man. Didn't need that. here and the bear kill oh man where's the bear kill is it over here where's our wolf kill this pack is getting kind of... that sparks a bit. you know I wonder if I should build the fire here and bring the meat up you know I think that's probably a smart thing I'm trying to find a place that's sheltered the most. I don't like the way this wind is blowing. Ah. Maybe over here? This is kind of a sheltered area. too steep. You know, I'm going to drop this rabbit. I'm probably attracting the wolves. You can eat anything. Huh. All right. Well, bring this guy over here. Now, somebody said there was a cave up across that bridge. windy and we are taking damage Try it right here. I can bring the bags over here, and I can try to get them harvested up. Come on, little fire. I'm not sure I can carry much more. Uh -huh, too heavy. Ow. Mm, I'm gonna need some first aid soon. Let's grab these pieces of meat to get this cooking. Freezing. We have a wolf friend coming. Mm. 
Hey, Wolfie. Plenty of time there. Okay, nine minutes on that one. Okay, 35 minutes. Oh man, that crazy wind. Let's see if I can get some tea heated up at least. minutes. Okay. Well, that wind took away all of our firewood. We had, I think I had quite a bit of time on here. It's too bad. Well, what do I want to do? If we could keep this place sheltered, you know, I wouldn't mind staying here. We are kind of warming up. Well, let's try it. Let's see if it will let us harvest this. Fire's gone out. Okay. Well, that answers that question. Did I get? A, I got a bunch more meat harvested at least. Um, yeah, we'll take all this with us. That's probably good for now. Get a flare out. It's kind of a shame the weather turned bad. I had so much to do. 
Would have liked to have harvested this wolf carcass. Hey, we got a rabbit here. Hey, Wolfie. Want a rabbit? over there. Oh, it's fire. Okay. Well, he's welcome to follow us. Although I do have the crappy blue flare. I don't think the blue flare, flare is going to last long enough. But we can try it. sheltered here. Uh, but I don't want to stay here. Um, hmm. Do I want to use another flare? Where are the flares? Is that it? Okay. Do we just have the one flare? Wow. Well, I could leave the food. Um, don't really have that far to go. Man, taking damage this whole time as well. Um, shoot, let's get a fire. Is it going to let me? Gonna be warm enough? Let's see, negative five. That's it is rising slowly. Negative two, negative one, and we're warm. Maybe? Can we get one more? You 
know, I would put coal on this fire, except I'm actually kind of concerned it's going to blow out. Yeah, like that. See, the wind just shifted, guys. It is so cold. Yeah, it's not going to stay lit. Okay, well, let's grab a flare. I think we have more flares possibly back at the Ow. maintenance yard. I'm not sure I can carry much more. And I'm going to leave those guys. Well. Oh, hey. Weather is clearing up. Is that another wolf? That sparks a bit. Hey, it's another wolf kill. It's a bit. Nice. Well, let's get back to our safety. Hey, Wolfie, you can follow us if you want. Wonder why he gave up. Well, I'm hoping we have more flares inside so I can replenish what I've been using here. There's a wolf. Hey, Wolfie. I'll tell you what, I, I took a lot more damage than I thought I would there. Let's head inside. Okay, we're back safe and sound. Got a fire striker, but don't know if we have any flares. No flares. Oh, 
Oh, there we go. Blue flares right there. Okay. Well, that's better than nothing. Now let's see what the weather's doing. I need to pass some time here. Yeah, it's a little too cold and windy for my liking to go grab the rest of the meat. Well, uh, it's kind of a shame I had to use a flare there. Yeah, I, d I did pick up another flare though, right? The blue flare? There we go. Yeah, we do. We do have two blue flares. Sun is going down. Man, look at the amount of damage we took there. Alright, well, I guess I could, uh, we could get this fire started. Come on, little fire. All right. Well, we could probably get some, um, try to get some arrowheads crafted up. get some water on there as well. You know, I think we are out of water uh, in general. Or wait, didn't I just, maybe I just saw a bunch of water. Maybe we have enough. Yeah, we did get all this water, okay. Let me put this in here. Okay, well, as, uh, I guess as long as we have enough heat, we should be able to craft up some arrowheads. Okay, it's currently we have seven arrows. So let's see, 150 degrees, that's what we're aiming for. It's getting up there. And add one more, see if that brings us up there. Hundred forty eight degrees. Um, can't add any more fuel. Well, let's see if I can take some torches out. I guess I shouldn't have put so much uh, reclaimed wood on there. See if that will let us add another coal. 142. Yeah, let's go for it. Okay. 
It's going to take an, an hour. Wow. Okay. Um, let's get a drink first. Okay, now, question is, do we want another knife? It's going to take three hours. Whoa. I wonder if I can drop any of this gear. Well, let's go for the uh, arrowheads for now. Oh, wow. We got an aurora. Don't know... I don't think that affects anything. Okay, let me check the uh, condition of our knife. So I think I am out of sharpening stones. Oh, it's 100%. Okay. I think I think we are down to our last sharpening stone, or maybe maybe we used it all. Um. You know, I'm just gonna go for it. Let me get a drink first. Let's make another knife. Man, this pack is getting kind of heavy. Okay, let's go for it. Okay. And then I think I will make uh, some more arrowheads. I'll just keep going. May as well make a bunch. I'm gonna need to rest soon. Okay, one more. Last one. Nice. Let's get a drink. Okay, I've got uh, 21 minutes until boiled. Don't think I have any more cured rabbit pelts. Let's go see. Well, we are not hurting for water, and if we get that bear meat back here, we'll be pretty set for bear meat here. Let's just drop all of this. Okay, is that cured? Hey, nice! Okay, it is cured. Fresh gut. Um, let's see, do I have any cured guts? I do. So let's go ahead and fix, is it the hat? No, it's got to be the mitts. Yeah, let's go for it. Ah, uh, 90%, nice. Ow. <laughs> It's almost like that bounce back and hit her. Okay, there's something in my way here. Let's grab this. I'm not sure I can carry much more. Pick that up. Um, let's grab a torch. Uh. 
Just throw these around. You know what? I'm going to go to sleep and we will I'll just leave some water cooking. That may be about the right amount of time. I'll have to see. drink. Hopefully I've got enough food where we can uh, sleep through the night. 750, 746. Okay. Um, I definitely want to heal up as long as I can. So I think I'm going to go eat just a little bit more meat. Let's make sure we get our full 10 hours of sleep. That last hour is going to give us a ton of health uh, regeneration compared to the other hours. So let's get some meat here. Okay, that one is cooked, right? Okay, let's eat that. There we go. And that's it for that's it for the torch. Uh, better get some light. I'm bumping into everything. Huh. Okay, kind of got close to the bed. in the morning. Alright, that's pretty good health recovery. I think I'm happy with that. And we're feeling much better today, it looks like. Um, let me get the water before I forget, mostly because I just want the pot. I'm curious if... Uh, my little experiment worked here. Let's see. Non-potable water. Okay, didn't quite work. So I will drop those. Stick them back here. And how much charcoal do I have? Sort alphabetically, got two. That's the right amount. Let's drop a bunch of these extra torches. Okay, nice. I'm just doing a little tidying up. Um, let's see what else I can drop before we head out. Possibly getting some more of that meat. Could drop a bunch of our coal here. I will come back for that before we leave. It's like I do need to craft up another bandage at some point. Uh, clothing looks pretty good. I 
can drop a liter of this. Oh, the heavy hammer. Yeah, let's get rid of that. Okay, I think we're actually good to go out now. Let's uh, see what the weather's like today. Oh, I should have crouched down right there. Not too bad there. Uh, temperature wise, it's good, but I don't really like the snowflakes coming down. Let's see if I can hurry and get this taken care of. So, what? I think we had two wolves. I think we had two wolves that we killed. All right. I wouldn't mind harvesting up those guys with two wolves. So I've been uh, just off offline here, off of recording. I've been having kind of some fun playing the wideout challenge again. And I'm getting pretty close to finishing that up. I w I'm kind of curious what uh, score I'm going to get. But uh, when I finish that, maybe I'll maybe I'll post the last few minutes of it here. If you're interested, I never really thought anybody would be interested in watching the uh, whiteout challenge. Um, so, if that's something you guys would want to see, let me know if you have any interest in seeing the, the whiteout challenge. That is the challenge where you've got to round up a whole bunch of uh, supplies before a big storm comes in. And, uh, you know, it, it is kind of a fun challenge. I don't know if it's all that interesting to watch. I wonder if our if the wolf is still here that uh, was buried in the snow. Is he like over here somewhere? Whoa. Okay, here's uh is he gone? Maybe he's gone. I don't see him. I think he was in this area. This looks like he may have despawned. I wonder if I can drop any of this gear. Get these up here. Okay, um, do I want to get a fire started or just go for it? Let's get a fire started. Come on, little fire. Come on. Oh. 
Uh, let's do a coal. We can stay nice and warm while we harvest. Let's do one kilogram at a time. about the snow. Now we lucked out with the wind direction. Okay, 15 minutes. So far, so good. Thirty eight minutes on the fire. Here we go. Get a drink. It's actually going pretty well. Just glad that wind uh, changed direction. Eight minutes. Getting there. Last one. The sun is setting. A lot colder soon. Okay, now, the question is what do we want to do, 11 minutes, you know what, I think I will, um, let's get some meat cooking. Uh 
Oh no, it's another Aurora. <laughs> of course. Okay, I want to separate this meat out. So we're only taking the cooked meat. Let's see. Let's put the raw meat over here. Yeah, I tell you what, this game really does uh, know when to throw a curveball at you. Seems like whenever we're out here cooking, we're going to get an Aurora. You know, I may as well just wait it out. May as well. 28 minutes and 30 minutes. I don't think I would have stayed here and tried to cook up all this meat if we didn't get the Aurora. You know, one thing I could do is hug that side and try to walk around to the rope and then climb up the rope and then uh, just stay in the hunter's lodge. That's one thing we could do. I don't especially want to use up all the coal for cooking right now. It is beautiful. Um, but I think it's probably time to go. Yep, there we go. Our fire just blew out. So let's get... Um, do we have any tea? I could drop one of these. Make sure that's heating up. Oh, we can't heat it up. I thought we could. What do we have here? Drop one of these. Might actually be too late though. Five minutes? No, no, we should be okay. Heat up a reishi tea. You know, I thought we could heat up this broth. I guess you have to cook with it though, don't you? All right, well, I'm gonna try to sneak around these wolves. Get up that rope. It really is quite cold. Uh, you know, someone was saying there's a cave up here. Should we try for that? I said there's a cave through the gate and up, up the hill. Let's 
Let's see if we can get through here. Yeah, I guess we're going this way, guys. <laughs> um, okay, I don't know where the cave is. I'm going to kind of look around. Is it over here? No, that's just a drop down. That's where we came from. Let's drink our tea. Okay, get a little warmth out of that. I wonder if it's the cave that was up by the moose. Wasn't there a moose spawn up here? I thought there was. Maybe there's a cave. I think on the other side of where the moose can spawn. Either way, let's head up here. I'm glad we got a full belly before we headed up here. Whoa, look at the snow. That is cool. Okay, we're keeping an eye out for a cave. I think it's like straight over there, if that's the one I'm thinking of. Um, or we could try to just sneak into the uh, Hunter's Lodge. Let me see if we could see any wolves over there. Even though I've been cooking up all that bear meat, hopefully I don't smell like bear. You'd think all that smoke and fatty bear meat would leave a smell on your clothing. There's a wolf way over there. Just gonna try to be sneaky. We'll make our way over to the uh, hunting lodge. Are those reishi mushrooms? Oh, I wanna get those. Well, I was really hoping I could harvest up that other wolf before it despawned. But then this aurora came in. Oh, that's fine. Uh, we got plenty of meat. Um, it's really not that big a deal if the wolf despawns. We can always kill more wolves if we need it. Okay, I want to be careful here. I don't even know where the wolves are. Uh-oh. Did I just hear a wolf? Yep. Guess he saw me when I stood up. I don't even know where he is. Where are you, wolf? Maybe we could try to outrun him. I really don't know where he is. Oh, I didn't have time to size him up. So we got an affliction, infection. Uh, it's possible I have blood loss. Do I? Blood loss. Yep. Yes, I will. Man, I don't even know how he saw me. I think I just took too big of a risk there. Okay, infection risk. Let's just get inside. If I'd known where he was, guys, I probably would have ran for the uh, for the hunter's lodge. I would have just made a run for it. Let's go through the back side. I 
And we're right back where we were as far as the health loss. <laughs> ah, well, that's uh, that's my own fault for standing up, really. I was trying to be sneaky, and then I'm like, oh well, there's no wolves nearby, so I stood up. Well, we did make it safely. Well, we could call it safely. We're still alive, and we made it back here <laughs> to the Hunter's Lodge. Uh, I'm not very happy about that. Um, if I could do it over, I would... Maybe I would have just gone to the cave. If I Probably would have been good. Or uh, just not stand up like that. Anyway, guys, I think this is a good place to call it an episode. Um, we're going to try to heal up for the night. And uh, we're right about the mark for the, uh, for the episode here. Um, so thanks for coming along with me. I do hope you'll come along in the next episode where we hopefully will recover from these injuries. Uh, my pride will have he healed a little bit from poor decisions. <laughs> don't don't really know what I would have done differently. You know, obviously hindsight, I would have be a little more sneaky around the wolf, but uh, all in all, not too bad. So anyway, thanks guys for coming along with me, and I do hope to catch you in the next episode. Take care.